shit. Another new boy. <laughs> Here for the gold, too, aren't you? Gold? Quit trying to kid me. All the new boys who come here want into the mine. But don't think it's that easy. How do I get to the camp? Just follow the boardwalk. But if you want to get into the mine, you'll have to get past Franco. He expects all the new boys to slave away out here for a while first. Tell me more about the mine. I'll give you some good advice. If you want to get in there, get in good with Franco. He's the boss out here. He decides who is the next to go in. But he'll only let you in if you don't go brick out here. So go to him and let him give you a job. Where do I find this Franco? He mostly hangs out in the court in front of the camp. Getting good with him or you'll wind up with a crappy job like me. Do you have to hang around here all the time? I'm supposed to check out all the new boys to make sure that none of them are spies. But you can't forget it. I mean, we're at the end of the world here. In the middle of a swamp. No one can find us. No one will find us. And why should someone go to the trouble of sending us a spy? Never change. Hey, what are you doing here? Do you want to get into the camp? Yes, I am. 
I don't care who you are. I'm Franco. I'm the leader here. So, if you do a good job out here, I'll take you into the camp. Ramon, the gatekeeper will tell you if they need new people in the camp. Talk to him. Hey, what do you want, huh? I can't imagine you have a permit for the camp. Franco sent me. He wants to know if anyone is needed in the camp. Yeah, we need someone. Another one of the guys kicked the bucket yesterday. That idiot tangled with Esteban. Who is Esteban? The leader of the lower camp, he decides who gets into the mine. So tell Franco that Torres wants a new man. Got it? Torres? The Thoris? Yes, the Thoris. The man who calls for new people. The man who decides if and when a new guy gets out of the swamp and into the camp. You are trying to tell me that you know him from earlier? Well, yes. Listen, everyone knows Thoris. Nevertheless, you aren't getting in, and I won't give him a message. Hey! Thoris needs a new man. Good. I'll take care of it. Wait a minute. What about me? You haven't done anything yet. I've done a lot. Only you don't know about it. Okay. You want a chance. You'll get your chance. Move your butt to Logan. The Swamp Sharks are breathing down his neck. Help him finish off the beasts, and you're as good as in the camp. Where do I find Logan? If you're standing in front of the camp entrance, follow the rock wall to the left. It's a bit farther into the swamp. Things I could tell you. You better watch out. What are you doing here? Are you looking for something? Plants. I'm looking for plants. Most of the stuff that grows here can be used for something. Many plants have healing properties, and you can smoke swamp weed reefers. Before my time behind the barrier, I worked as an alchemist. Why did they put you behind the barrier? I worked with mind-altering potions. A lot. One evening, my master Ignaz drank my experiment instead of his wine. That rendered him temporarily, uh, unpredictable. And since then, he's been somewhat confused. The mages had me thrown behind the barrier for that. Research into forbidden knowledge, they called it. What can you tell me about the camp? Not much. I have never been in there myself. Only Raven's people were there from the beginning. All the others who came later, like me, have to wait until they need new people. Where did you come from? Well, the same way as you, I suppose. With the pirates, over the sea. The valley here is completely cut off. There's no connection over land. Right. When do they need new people? Well, when they're missing some in there. If a digger gets himself eaten by a mine crawler, they let one of us replace him. Sometimes they also kill each other. But they've been better about that lately. Raven has controlled the access to the mine somehow so that not everyone can get in at the same time. But I don't know exactly how that works. 
ever been inside. Can you teach me something? Mm, no time. I am here to get gold, and as long as I can't get into the camp, I make a living by selling my herbs. But if you need a few potions, I still have some. Let's deal. Why are you sitting around here? I've got problems. At the moment, it's better for my health if I'm not seen in the camp. What's wrong? I had really good relations with some of the pirates, you see. I was always meeting the boys outside their camp and trading. Man, I bought stuff for half the camp. Tom, bring me this. Tom, bring me that. And then that bastard Esteban got in between. What happened? Esteban sent Juan. One of his boys. The bastard waylaid us. I was just about to deal with the pirates when he came out of the dark and knocked me down with two blows. Man, that guy is fast, but not fast enough. I was able to get away from him. And since the ambush, you've been hiding here. First, I went back to the camp and let Fisk, Huno, and the others know that they could forget their delivery. And that Esteban was behind it. If Esteban finds out that I told the others that he was responsible, I'm dead. That's why I can't go back to the camp. What else? Well, I'll just sit here counting rocks.
Look, a new face. Are you just gonna stand around here, or have you come to help me? Franco sent me. He says you could use some help. So, what's up? The swamp sharks are coming a little too close for me. High time to finish off a few of them. What do I get for my help? Franco will let you rot here if you do nothing. If you want to get into the camp, you'll have to lend a hand. You won't get any further here with just words. Besides, I can show you how to gut the beasts. But don't think Franco will send you straight into the camp just because we've had a little fun with the swamp sharks here. There are people out here who have been waiting a long time to get in. And the next one who gets in is me. It had better be me. What's in the camp, then? The question is what isn't in the camp. There are no swamp sharks, no swamp holes, no swamp at all. Instead, they have booze and gold. As far as I know, they even have a woman. Got it? Let's attack the swamp sharks. You figured out how to get ahead here. I'm pleased. Hey, you hear that? Oh, yeah, I hear them. I see. And what do we do now? They're coming. They've got an appetite for a bite of human flesh. <laughs> well, we'll see who gets eaten here. <laughs> Let's go. Another one of those things. <laughs> The only good swamp shark is a dead swamp shark. That'll be a warning to their brothers. All right. Is there anything else to do? Otherwise, I'll take off. Do that. If you want to learn anything else, you know where to find me. I helped Logan. Okay, so you fought the Swamp Sharks. You're useful. At least more so than most of the guys here. That's no secret. So can I go to the camp now? Listen, there's another thing I need you for. A few days ago, I sent Edgar into the swamp. He was supposed to get me an old stone tablet, but he hasn't been seen since. See what he's... and bring me that damn stone tablet. Been all kinds of rumors. What about gold? What? Do I get anything for my work here in the swamp? You want exactly gold? What I said. Sure. How much do you want? Simply Fifty gold nuggets. A hundred. I'll give you, you as much gold as you can carry. Who do you think you are? Are you trying to make a fool out of me? Now push off and do something. Otherwise, you won't get so much as one crumb of gold. You have to feel sorry. You can't rely on that. Nothing's ever going to change that.
Hey, you! How's it going? You wanna know how it's going? I'll tell you how it's going. First, some pirates brought me here on a stormy night. Man, I barfed all over that nutshell. Then Raven locked up the mine because some idiots are too greedy for gold. And then Franco became the leader of the hunters, killing anybody who's against him. I'd say it's going pretty badly. Franco get to be the leader. Quite simply, he killed Fletcher. He was the leader of the hunters before. Fletcher was okay. Franco's just jerking us all around. Franco sent me here about that stone tablet. Have you found it? Man, I haven't even looked for it. All I know is it's supposed to be in this old building deep in the swamp. And my inner voice tells me, Edgore, stay far away from old buildings deep in the swamp. I certainly won't risk my ass for that bum Franco. Where exactly is this old building? Just go left past the big rock here. After a while, you'll come to another big rock. You have to go left or right past that one. I don't know anymore. It was too long ago. But the ruins are supposed to be on some sort of rise. All but hidden among plants. Maybe you'll get lucky and you won't find it. I found the stone tablet. Really? You must be a brave guy. Then you've certainly earned your way into the camp. <sighs> Can you teach me something? I know a lot about blood flies. I hate those miserable beasts. Even more than I hate Franco. But I know how to tear the stingers and wings from their dead bodies. Yeah, tear them out! Besides that, I know how to remove the secretion from the stinger. If you want, I can teach you all that junk. Of course, nothing is free out here. It was nice knowing you. Here's the stone tablet. Good, very good. Raven will be pleased with you. That will never change. What about the camp now? Can I finally go in? No, I already sent Logan here. He was ahead of you in the list. And at the moment, there's no need for another man in the camp. Besides, I can really use you here. Now that Logan isn't here anymore. Do you really think? Send me in now. And what if I say no? You have to feel sorry. Then you'll simply regret it. Are you threatening me? You want to threaten me? It's time for a lesson. Hey, what happened down there? I flattened Franco. So? Then now it's your job to make sure the lazy dogs do their work every day. Hey, I'm not here to be bothered with the hunters. I want to enter the camp. Forget it. You did in Franco. Now you're the leader. So do your job. If I'm the leader, then I decide who goes in next. And I decided that I'm next. <laughs> it isn't that easy. We haven't asked for anyone, so no one gets in. Thoris can send a new leader for the Hunters. Then there will be a vacancy inside for me. <laughs> you don't give up, do you? Okay. Then move your butt inside. Thoris will make sure that the Hunters won't have to live without a leader. What are you waiting for? And get yourself a pickaxe. And there's more, believe me.